Hey guys, welcome back. We're back in the shop today. Uh, we spent some time this morning. We found some tires that we wanted to run. We went with 18 inch by nine and a half, which is an inch wider than what we had on it. And they're on an eight inch rim. So really happy with the look that it gave the tractor. Um, what we're gonna be doing today is mocking up and fitting our fenders because we had to, because we dropped the tractor so low we now need to make sheet metal to come up and out this way and we want to keep as much of the original tractor as we can so we're using these on the outsides uh, stick along with us and we'll get at it okay guys we've got some old air hose lying around that I'm going to use to space the fender up to start that'll give us our clearance to the tire and then I'm going to use a bunch of cardboard and start mocking it all up conveniently we have a bunch of empty beer cases lying around so we're just going to start cutting them and get it to fit our fender Okay, now we've got all our hose laid into the fender here. We can put it back on and we can see that now gives us the clearance all around the tire in here uh, so that the tire doesn't hit the fender. This, this, tri this tractor doesn't have any suspension so we're not worried about the tire moving up and down. I've got strips welded in here to hold the fender up this they're probably gonna end up coming out after the fact but it gives us a good position starting point uh, the, it keeps the fender from moving it also allows us they're thin enough that we can tweak the fender each way we want to get it lined up perfectly but before we go any farther we want to pull the tire off and make sure we can pull the tire off make sure everything clears and if that works then we're gonna jump to the other side and do the same thing Okay, we've got both our fenders mocked up where we want them. Now all I gotta do is start laying out the cardboard templates. We're gonna come straight up off the back here, and then we're just gonna start laying our cardboard out, get the top figured out, and then we're gonna have to figure out how we're gonna fill in here, and the same thing on the back. Okay guys, as you've seen, um, we got the fender, the whole back of it all mocked up. 
I'm really happy with the way it's coming out. We need to fill in the front of it. So again, we're gonna take some cardboard templates, lay it out, trace it out. And we've got these pieces here and we're gonna lay them in, just trim them up a little bit and then weld it in. And then uh, this side should be good to go. Okay guys, we got this side all tacked into place. We're happy with how it turned out. It looks really nice. We're gonna do the same thing on this side and uh, we'll get right back. Okay guys, we got this side finished up last night and uh, early this morning. Uh, the fenders are on the tractor. Hopefully next week, what? You think we're gonna get to the motor? I hope we can mount the motor yeah, next hopefully week. Hopefully yeah. we'll start mounting the motor next week. So stay tuned, give us a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next week.